Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a game that I have played more than probably most other games except one. But um, this is a game that I played uh, quite a bit, a game that I know pretty well, but I just enjoy playing it. And as you can see, it is Elder Scrolls Oblivion. <coughs> uh, taking a little break from the horror games because I just I don't want to be doing exclusively horror games because. I just, it's just not, not me. I'll still do horror games, it's just, I will go out of my way, you know what I mean? But we're gonna go ahead and start, and I'll be quiet while it does the intro with Sir Patrick Stewart. I was born 87 years ago. For 65 years, I've ruled as Tamriel's emperor. But for all these years, I've never been the ruler of my own dreams. I have seen the gates of oblivion, beyond which no waking eye may see. Behold, in darkness a doom sweeps the land. This is the 27th of Last Seed, the year of Akatosh 433. These are the closing days of the Third Era, and the final hours of my life. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what do I know? <clears throat> this is a game that marks a pretty good chunk of my childhood. I played this before Skyrim, and it's it's one that means a lot to me because I feel like they were more open with everything you could do. The guild quests are a lot more detailed, and, and they're a lot more flushed out. Yes, everybody looks like a potato, but just okay. <laughs> I always play as an Imperial or a High Elf. I'm probably going to do I'm probably gonna do Imperial because that's pretty that's pretty base class. Don't have to worry about nothing. Get my favorite, which is military, because we have a bandana. Yay! Okay. My eyes are brown. I'm not old. We'll make ourselves fairly young. We'll go right about there. We'll go right like that. Uh, let's enter a name. This is for a friend of mine who, every single time he, every single time I play any game that has character creation, I ask him, and this was one that, well, that was the most famous, Timothy Bibbleton. We'll go the fourth, sorry. There we go. Timothy Bibbleton the Fourth. First of his name. And in tradition with Timothy Bibbleton, we max out the sliders and make him look fuck ugly. Because Timothy Bibbleton's family tree is very. Very strange looking. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, it's already scuffed. Oh, sweet lord. 
I'm so sorry. <laughs> he looks like a fucking alien. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go wide jaw. Oh my god, he looks like the Chad meme from from certain angles. Oh my god. Uh Oh, what that mouth do? There we go. <laughs> oh, Ron Stone. Behold the savior of Sirity and the Bible in the fourth. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Now we gotta make him look like even more of a freak. Oh. There we go. The hero of Cyrodiil. The... The savior of of a the sealer of oblivion. <laughs> God, we look like we hit a fucking tree on the way down. Holy shit. <laughs> I guess they don't play favorites, huh? Your own kinsmen think you're a piece I'm of out. human trash. Let me out. How sad. Wait, let me turn on, uh, let me turn, see if I can turn on subtitles. Uh, was that being gameplay? Yeah, there we go. I bet the there we go, so y'all can read in case you can't hear. Before the end. Oh, that's right. You're going to die in here, Imperial. You're going to die. Okay, so the one way this game is unique is you can basically only hold weapons in one hand. Your right hand. Magic is in your left hand. Best if you just disappear. Hold on, uh, again, I, I apologize, I'm not used to, to, um, to the controls on keyboard, so you'll have to forgive me. Okay, F. And C. Okay. Alright, we're good. Sorry about that, y'all. But you can have different magic and everything. No, they're dead. I know it. My job right now is I'll to get you I'll to get through this. I'll, I'll, I'll get What's through this What's this prisoner before, doing uh, here? This cell is supposed to be off limits. Before we get into any more detail. The usual mix up with the watch. I... Never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. All right. Touche. I don't like dying. Over by the window. Stay out of the way and you won't get hurt. No Stay put, prisoner. Good. Let's Do go. I look like a man to, to be trifled it. with? You. I've seen you. Let me see your face. You I'm are the one, one from my dreams. Or nightmares. Then the stars were right. And this is the day. Gods give me strength. What's going on? Assassins attacked my sons, and I am next. My blades are leading me out of the city along a secret escape route. 
By chance, the entrance to that escape route leads through your cell. Why am I in jail? Perhaps the gods have placed you here so that we may meet. As for what you have done, it does not matter. That is not what you will be remembered for. Who are you? I am your emperor, Uriel Septim. By the grace of the gods, I serve Tamriel as her ruler. You are a citizen of Tamriel, and you too shall serve her in your own way. What should I do? You will find your own path. Take care. There will be blood and death before the end. Please, sire, we must keep moving. Better not close this one. There's no way to open it from the other side. Looks like this is your lucky day. Just stay out of our way. We'll follow along behind for a little while. <coughs> but while we have the time... All right, we haven't got into birth birth sign or classes yet, but basic stats and everything, you know, you know this. Like Fallen has special, we have Suasel, Seppel, Suasepel. You have different skills and everything. There's a lot you can you can max out all of them, but I I very rarely do. Uh, of course, factions. Everybody knows about factions in, in Elder Scrolls and Bethesda games. This is your inventory for basic items. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. But you already have different uh, abilities starting out. The, typically, the, you always have Heal Minor Wounds and Flare, but the greater power up here comes from your your race skills. Voice of the Emperor lets you charm people, and this is passive, I believe. You absorb fatigue, 100 points on touch. You can equip everything, but and you use on key on keyboard. You, you hit C to use it, but I typically just keep uh keep it on. And we also have auto walk. I don't know why I'm moving so dang slow. Actually, we might want to swap to the up left. Protect the Emperor. Protect the, Emperor. the captain's down. We'll just, uh. Oh, okay, hold on. I can get there. Nope. Nope. Sorry, sir. There we go. Like I said, you'll have to forgive me. I'm not used to keyboard controls. I've played this on console more times than I'd care to say. But we'll equip this while we have it. Keep quiet and stay out of it. They've been waiting for us here. Yes. Go and take this because it's some better oh, no. armor. They won't be the first to underestimate the blades. I'll take point. Let's move. You stay here, prison. Don't try to follow us. Sorry about that, I had to blow my nose. Oh no, we, they locked us behind. Um, another thing is, in Oblivion, weapons have health. And of course, whenever it gets low, the weapon breaks and you can't use it. But we do have th things that we can get called repair hammers. And repair hammers kind of do exactly what you think. It repairs it. But we'll we'll keep on trucking. Actually, hold on. Let me see if there's a uh, if I can still favorite stuff. Nope. Yeah, it'll be fine. But we'll search this. We'll. We'll get a handful of different things. 
You want to grab plenty of torches. Because torches do... Uh, go out after a little while. Alright, the lock picking in this game, I'll be the first to admit, it's kind of trash. Yeah, it's 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 pretty rough. Good lord, hold on, let me turn up the brightness on this. Ba -ba 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 -ba. That should be a little better for y'all. Stop! There we go. But we there's goblins in this game. And I love goblins. Goblins are always fun to deal with in games. But the ones in these, they're unique. But uh, we'll uh we'll get, try to get some little stealthy skills. Whenever we get to where we cr actually create our uh our class and everything. I'll go into detail on how <clears throat> that works. We'll take the rusty pat. You know what? We'll just take everything. One other downside uh, con that this game has is when you're over and come, do you just stop moving? Zambambos in this game. And that's all we're gonna take from from homeboy here. But uh the start the start is a bit slow, but we'll uh We'll go on, and I'll I'll play through like how I normally play through this game, because I'll side with one of my favorite factions, and the faction that I was side with is the Dark Brotherhood, and you all will get to see why I say that uh, the guild quest in this game I like a lot more than the guild quest in Skyrim. Because the guild quests in Skyrim are just... They're... They're boring. I i won't lie. I don't like them. I don't like them. They're... They're short. They're not fun. I'll probably get hate for it, but... That's, that's one way that I don't like Skyrim. Get out of here! We got fire! Uh, you got the bow. We'll use this katana for a little while. Because, spoiler, we won't get to use it. We won't get to use it for very long. Fuck! There we go. Jesus! Like, that, again... Why can't I jump? Hold on. Why won't it let me jump?
Oh, jump is E? God, that's weird. Hold on, we're gonna change that. Jump is space. And activate is E. Okay. Much better. Good lord, that was weird. But I'm just gonna collect a handful of things to mainly sell... Because money's really easy to get in this game, I won't lie. It is stupidly easy to get. Especially if you go with the Dark Brotherhood. Because unlike the Dark Brotherhood in Skyrim, Dark Brotherhood in Oblivion, you get paid handsomely. <coughs> oh god, excuse me. You get paid handsomely. and But unfortunately, the one guild quest that I, I haven't done a whole lot, so I don't know a lot of, I don't have a lot of experience with it, is, um, at least in this game, is the Thieves' Guild. I know people love the Thieves' Guild. But I haven't done it in this one. I've beaten this game a whole lot, but I've only done a handful of the different factions. Ah! Back. I didn't finish exploring. Okay, I did finish exploring. The goblin up ahead hasn't seen us yet. We can take the fucker down. all sneaky like fireball and if I can get into it later on I'll show you one of the single most broken things in all of gaming Which is, uh, you can create your own spells in this game. The only stipulation is you gotta have a bunch of money. And you gotta have a bunch of, um, you have to have a decent amount of, uh, skills in whatever you're wanting to make. Sorry, sorry. Hello, buddy. Yeah, the the katana's very good, so naturally we don't get to keep it for long. But fear not, we will get to keep it. We, will, we won't get to keep it. We will get another version. Just as good. But we might have to steal it. Well, borrow, because let's face it, we're the hero, we get what we want. You're gonna see a magic trick. And they're gone! I don't use daggers a whole lot. That's just me. If I'm going to use something, I'm going to use it right. But you see, we're already almost maxed out. So what I will do... I'll put that on. Oh god, how do I drop shit? Oh god, again, this this will this will be the only episode that has me trying to learn different shit. Alright, let's see. Damn it, stop. How do I drop?
Oh, I can hotkey. There we go. Okay. We'll put on the Mythic Dawn hood to look so totally red. Oh my god, I am so embarrassed. I am so sorry, you guys. Nope. Anyway, while we're here, I'll go ahead and uh, hotkey some stuff. No. There we go. Uh, three. Four. Five. Actually, we'll go. And then for it, are you all? I am so sorry about that. But I got everything figured out, don't you worry. I'll drop the war hammer because I don't use big weapons. I only need one of those. Okay. That's a lot of stuff. Like I said, I apologize for that little, uh, for that little interruption. <laughs> and for me failing miserably to, on basic reading. But yes, this series will be... I'll do... What I'm gonna do is I, I do have a plan for future games that I'm gonna play. I have a long list. But the live streams uh, will continue to be horror games. I promise you that. The live streams will continue to be horror, so everybody can get their their jollies on watching me get scared shitless. But yeah, it'll be fun. I have a long list, and I do have some unique ideas for for a few of the games that I'm playing. Um. It's gonna be it's gonna be different, and it is gonna cover some tough subject matter. But I will put a disclaimer at the beginning of the video, so that everybody can be f f uh, fairly warned, so that nobody gets surprised or and gets triggered by anything, so they don't get traumatized. Hell, I, I, I would feel very bad if somebody got we need to get the or, uh, I got hurt. Oh. Or, uh, I'm just trying to make people feel good. I'm trying to make people feel happy. Damn it! It's that prisoner again! Kill him! He might be working with the assassins! You're rude. No, he is not one of them. Thank you, Patrick. He Stewart. can help us. He must help us. As you They cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can I explain? Listen, you know the Nine, how they guide our fates with an invisible hand. I've served the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one a sign. I know these stars well, and I wonder... Which sign marked your birth? Okay, this is where we get into the rest of the character creation. There's many, many, many different signs. Uh, let's see. Bum, 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 bum. I'll probably go Thief because uh, I do enjoy agility, speed, and luck bonuses. The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. What about me? Your stars are not mine. 
Today the thief shall guide your steps on the road to destiny. Are you not afraid to die? No trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not the hour. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death, to face my apportioned fate, then fall. My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory may banish the coming darkness. With such hope, and with the promise of your aid, my heart must be satisfied. Where are we going? I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. Whatever you say, you sir. You may as well okay. make yourself useful. Here, carry this. Who are the blades? We're the Emperor's bodyguards. Our job is to get him out of situations like this. Although I admit, things are not going according to plan. Ariel My job is to make sure the Emperor gets out of here. All right, good talk. Stick close. Okay? I will say you do have to be careful because you can accidentally attack uh, any of these three, and th you will—they'll kill you fairly quickly because you are a low-level scrub lord, and they will—they will dunk on you. There's no time to talk. Sorry, now. sorry, wrong button. Not much fun. Touch! The Emperor's in danger. <laughs> For the Emperor! Take the potion of sorcery. Um, in the beginning, the, uh, the Mythic Dawn are a, are a very, very good source of some really good early game potions. Die, you son! Yep, I'm getting right on that, I promise. There we go. See, you didn't really need my help. We'll, uh, we'll go ahead and, and equip a weapon that we get to keep, because like I said, we don't get to keep the katana, even though it's very good early on. Hold up. I don't like this. I don't like this. Actually, you know what? Let We're gonna use it until we can't use it anymore. Because by God, we've we've earned it. Looks clear. Come on. We're almost through to the sewers. I gotta say, for some sewers, these were some pretty nice looking sewers, my guy. Very nice looking sewer. Damn it! The gate is barred from the other side. A trap! What about that side passage back? Let's go! Let's go! It's a dead end. What's your call, sir? They're behind us! Wait here, sire. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with your life. I'll do my best. I certainly hope nobody comes up behind him and stabs him violently. Sir? Come with us. Your death. Um... I can go there no further. Go. You alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction and his mortal servants. He must not have the Amulet of Kings. Take the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close shut the jaws of oblivion. I'll do my best. Uh, sir? 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 Oh, God, no! No. 
Now we'll Tell go ahead save and swap us. weapons. We failed. I failed. The Blades are sworn to protect the Emperor. Now he and all his heirs are dead. The amulet. Where's the amulet of kings? It wasn't on the Emperor's body. The Emperor gave it to me. Strange. He saw something in you. Trusted you. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. Gross. They see more than lesser men. Probably. The amulet of kings is a sacred symbol of the Empire. Dope. Most people think of the red dragon crown, but that's just jewelry. The amulet has power. Only a true heir of the blood can wear it, they say. He must have given it to you for a reason. Did he say why? He told me I must Joffrey? take it to Joffrey. He said that? Why? There's no Nothing error. I ever heard about. But Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. Coral! First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were heading. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. Here, you'll need this key for the last door into the sewers. The sewers? There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced acrobat. Am I right? And this is where we create our class. But fuck doing that, we're gonna create our own. Combat. We get to pick two, so I'll pick strength and... Agility. And then seven major skills. We'll choose acrobatics, athletics, blade, uh, light armor, marksman, mercantile, snake. Actually, we'll take I'll take off mercantile under security. Uh, we will call it. Bimbleton. Bimbleton Way. We'll just call it Bimbleton. Create a Bimbleton class? Yes. Bimbleton. But there are many, many, many class classes. Uh, <coughs> but you can always create your own and it'll be fun. But you got acrobat, agent, archer, assassin, barbarian. The one that that I that I used to use a lot before I just started creating a class was spell was spell sword. Because spell sword, you you pretty much says it. You specialize in magic, but you also just use a sword. Because the only thing better than than that is you know than magic is stabbing. Really, Get I would never have guessed. Still. I don't think you'll have any trouble. After the sewers, then what? You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne in Priory immediately. I understand. Good. I'll stay here to guard the Emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. You better get moving. By the. Alright, hold on. Uh, where is he? I always like to check the the other body at the guy out there because some, some sometimes you get to uh, you might get I know it won't happen but I kind of hope you might get his armor because that armor's really 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 good. I get some stuff here. Open with Boris's key. Down to the sewers. Okay. Well, we'll go ahead and swap to flare. You probably saw you. You also have uh, scrolls. Scrolls basically it's a one-time use for whatever it is. And if it's a status effect, it just it just lasts a little. It it's 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 basically the same thing as Skyrim. Yeah, what we learn, rat. Do, 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 do. 
This is our last chance to change anything. Nope, we're gonna finish because the Bibbleton way is the only way. Jesus, sorry. Alright, uh, the red arrow basically shows where we gotta go. Well, fuck that, wait, wait a minute. That's a familiar looking plant people who have played Skyrim might know. Never mind, that's a mushroom. Oh, it's a crab! We'll take crab meat, why not? Uh. Well, weapon away. Actually, we'll put our weapon away. Yeah, underwater looks kinda scuffed. But oh god, oh why am I being attacked? What was attacking me? Yeah, what we learned, stupid fish. But what we're gonna try to do is we're uh, but uh, anyway, I'm sorry. The way you you level up is you have to upgrade. You have to level up. Where to go? The classes you put, the the skills you put your stuff into. Like any of these that we put our skills that we put our uh, our points into, we have to level them up. And whenever we level up, I think it's one or more of them. That's whenever you have to sleep to level up. Sleep in a secure location, but sleep nonetheless. There's also unique ways to do that. We'll get this guy. This is the part where you fall down. Uh. Whoa. Whoa. Uh. Take that and your lock pick. And what we will do real quick is that was what three? Yeah. And then we will drop the rusty iron bow because rusty weapons, as you can probably tell, the worst type of weapon. Like it's it's weak. It'll it breaks a lot easier. You, you get it. You're not stupid. I know you're not stupid. You beautiful bastards, you. Where was it? There it is. At a lot of these uh, places like this, you can draw power from the well. And it and uh, it'll give you a temporary stat boost or a, or a weapon or something. Let's see. Where is it? There we go. It fortifies your magic. Make basically makes it to where you know your magic doesn't go down as quickly. Oh god, sorry. Hold on, fuck console. Sorry. Give me an open the console command. I won't abuse the console command, but if I get somewhere where the game has soft locked, which is a strong possibility, I will use it to progress the story and the story alone. Guess it was nothing. Yeah, I hope everybody enjoys this series, because, with all due respect, if you don't, I'm just going to play through it anyway, because my channel, my rules. But it will be fun, my friends. It will be very, very fun. Let's see if we can get this guy. Sorry, lady. <laughs> uh, what an idiot. I need to heal, holy shit. Shit. Uh, gonna do a couple of the DLCs. I believe this. I have the DLCs. I can't specifically remember, but I will because these because uh, this game has, in my in my opinion, some of the best DLCs in the Elder ah! Scrolls game. Ah! Die. Let's get this over with. Die! Who's 
I bought my crap! Who's there? Who's there? Take that long sword, do some rearranging, because that long sword gonna be my main one. On the club. Making me oh shit, sorry, hold on. My bad. That would be what, seven? No. There we go. That's way everybody happy. Take that! Ha ha! Ah! Ha ha! cut. Let's put on the Amulet of the Kings. Oh no, we can't. Becker, boy. Yes, the wind. Because we're good like that. We got those the sweet skills, my gamer. We'll try some real quick. We can poison our longsword. Poison it very well today. Yes, we can. You can surely do that. Grave rubbing, yay! Okay. I doobie 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 leave. That is everything down here. We'll uh, do a quick double check. <clears throat> All right, we will return back up top, provided I can. I'm on fire. Remember how I got there. But yeah, this game's pretty interesting. We're gonna be doing this series for a while. Like I said, if when I'm not uh, live streaming, I won't be playing horror games. Horror games will be essentially live stream only, because you know, the least time I spend with horror games, the better. We'll see what's in the chest. Oh, there we go. Alright, we took his pants. Okay, what we're gonna do... I'm gonna iron boots to that. Get rid of that. Get rid of those. Get rid of that. And we'll keep the wrist irons. 
God, I forgot we look like a fucking potato. But most of the time, I like to have a mix of uh, heavy and light armor. Yeah, we'll take them. Why not? I like to have a mix of heavy armor and light armor, because it um, makes it to where you can... You have you're still lightweight and can move around a lot more, but you're not so lightweight that you're going to take damage out the wazoo. Some of the men were worried about these old ruins being haunted, but Mifala take them. This spot's going to be perfect for ambushing merchants along the road, and all under the nose of that of the Imperial Legion. Finally got some of those big blue stones down today. Bernice got the idea to shoot them down with her bow. Got them all here with me. I don't know what they are, but they stink of magicka. But they'll fetch a nice price with the Mage's Guild. Two coins two coins, and that Khajiit from Wardenfell set up their camps down the tomb. Fine by me, spares the rest of us the, the, the smell. Two coins ran up today. The Khajiit's gone missing. Swore to the nine that you could hear Claw scra scrabbling at limestone, but nothing's down there. Guessing she got tired of the smell and snuck out overnight. Two coin stench could peel all, could peel ha, shells off mud crabs. I'm surprised she hung around this long. So that means there's other things down here with us. We'll rest a little bit. But, uh, yeah, whenever you level up, it'll say you should rest on, uh, what you've learned. Or something along those lines. And you have to sleep, a and if you don't have any beds nearby, you can just rent a bed at one of the inns. It's, it's just as easy. Uh, you can rent one of the bed beds at the inn, rest there, level up. And it's pretty cheap. If not, you can just fucking murder somebody and take their bed. Whatever boats your float. Okay, we'll rest our weapon. And you run faster with your weapon sheathed or put away. We'll, we'll go ahead and get on to where we need to go. We'll find Joffrey. And not that little dick bag from Game of Thrones. <coughs> oh, excuse me, I am so sorry. Yeah, if you want to level up your acrobatics pretty uh pretty quickly, just jump the whole time. Not too far. Not when you're going downhill. You will die. Uh, but we have Nern Root. I've recovered a sprig of Nern Root. A plant ingredient that this unusual must have value. Uh, perhaps I should bring it to an alchemist and find out a little more about it. An alchemist can be found in almost every city in Cyrodiil. And much in Bethesda fashion... On our way to do one quest, we pick up several others. That crab had a lock pick, don't ask why. Oh dear lord. But, like I said, this game is incredibly fun. I love it to death. It's got a ton of replay value without being aggravating. Uh, you can do different playthroughs, you can do good playthroughs, bad playthroughs, and, like I said, any number of things. Oh, um, and you saw it said that you successfully harvested Nern Root. There's, uh, if you don't have high enough alchemy skill, you, you can try to, uh, harvest plants, but you, there's a good chance you'll fail. Uh, so you want to, if you want to do a lot of alchemy, you can, you can do it the, the normal way just by combining shit and hoping for the best. Or you could pick it 
harvest or harvest it, learn about it, and increase your skills. Because you can make some some stupidly strong po uh, potions and poisons in this game. I won't go into too much detail on how bad it can get, but things get pretty funky. But you want to do a ton of exploring because you can find some really good early game quests. And a lot of not so easy early game quests. Because there was one time I found a quest. I didn't know you could start. Hello? Am I supposed to be impressed? Yes. I learned it just for you. Why don't you love me? There's a lot of fur, but hey. That's just a theory. Oh, that makes me sad to think about it. I can't sleep with enemies nearby. What enemies? Ain't no enemies nearby. You're crazy, game. But I am just gonna go straight to, uh, to Wayland Priory so that we can get this quest started. But I'm very excited. And you also find stones like this throughout the world. Nope. Stones like this. The stone stirs under your hand. Do you want to conjure weapon and armor? And you'll get unique weapons. Uh, it does... This rusty piece of crap is actually pretty good. It's the bound dagger... And bound gauntlets. What do they do? So we shall go over. Basically, it's just your way of getting some cool weapons and armor. Uh, it goes away under two conditions. One, when the timers up in the top right corner go away. Or two, whenever you sheathe the weapon. Don't sheathe the weapon, because these things are really good early on. Because again, you're a weak little man, baby and everything can kill you at this point in time. But these are what the what the Daedric weapons look like, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I've never liked the look of Daedric weapons, but I will admit sometimes uh, sometimes they do look good and it and it, it they are growing on me. See that? Two shots. Boom boom, dead. Someone comes up, dead. Excuse me, tickle in my throat. I apologize for that. But this is going to be a really good game series. I'm excited to do it because I'm going to do this. I'm going to do New Vegas. Because New Vegas is and will always be my absolute favorite game. I'm excited for it. And I'm excited for for everyone to to, to experience it. Because, because as I said, it's bad as a demon. Uh, I'm so glad everybody gets to experience it because I want to spread my love for that game to ever to each one of you, in hopes that it becomes your favorite game as well. Where are you? There you go. Uh. But I have a couple minutes left in this recording session. Uh, sorry we did not get to Wayland Priory in this episode, or we might not, but let's face it, I'm getting distracted a lot, because this game is incredibly fun to explore in. We'll go to the top of this, and we'll see what, we, what happens next. I'm not closing out the episode, just stating a fact.
We'll see what's down here. Why not? We're grown adults. We can do what we want. Weird wooden doll. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the end of the first episode of Oblivion. I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope you all are excited for the rest of the series. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me suggestions for what you want me to do, how you want me to play, or what you want me to play, and I'll see you, and I will do my best on getting to it. You all have a wonderful day, and goodbye.